What's going on guys, Dr. Finn, Healthy Feet Podiatry. We got a pretty cool one today. If you like our channel, please subscribe and set yourself up for notifications so you'll never miss any brand new videos. It looked like a vein, that's what my medical assistant thought it was, but you know, through uh, my broken Spanish and her broken English, we figured out that it may or may not be a pencil that she stepped on 10 years ago. Un boligrafo, señora? Lapis. Lapis? La punta de un lapis. Da, uh, 10 años? ¿Cuánto tiempo año? Hace más de 10. Sí. Más de 10? So more than 10 years ago. Oh my gosh. So she's been dealing with this for a long time and it bothers her every time she wears a sandal. So I numbed her up. Let's test. ¿Tiene dolor? ¿Dueles? ¿Ha dormido? Ahora no. No, bueno. Okay, so it should pop up and out really easily. But who knows? You never know nowadays. It looks very superficial because you could really see it. So I'm just gonna make a small incision here and it should pop out. We'll give it to her so she can go home and write with it. It's like almost dissolved in there. You know, imagine a pencil tip being in there for that long. Does that show up in x-ray? It did not. No. Oh, wow. Oh my gosh. Mm. Wow, there it is. Piece of pencil, 10 years old. I feel like I'm an archaeologist. <laughs> I just found something that was buried in some ancient ruins for a long time. We're going to put it on display in our front case up there. Okay, mira, señora. Maria, por dia. Wow. Hay un lapiz. Un lapiz. Un punto de lapiz. Un punto de un lapiz. Okay, no más dolor, okay? So we're going to flush this out really well. And uh, send her home with, uh, I don't think we need any stitches. She'll heal really easily because it's so superficial, but she's not going to have that little dark spot anymore, okay? Well, thanks for tuning in. We'll have some other cool cases today, okay? Take care.